Hey, how's it going, everybody? Scott Spritzer here, DocSports.com. It is Football Thursday. It's Thursday, October 1st, 2020, and we got a free pick coming up. Uh, we're going to talk a little baseball, and then we're going to tell you everything about football, and my first football play will be available as far as a free pick on Thursday night's video. In fact, we're going to get that out early on Thursday so you get a chance to jump on some weekend college and pro football. Today, a free pick in baseball, but it is Football Thursday over at DocSports.com because on Thursday, we release our plays for the entire week weekend every single week throughout the football season at DocSports.com. I've got my college football plays, my NFL plays. It's almost 6.30 a.m. Eastern, 3.30 a.m. Pacific. Haven't been asleep yet because I had to finalize my football card. Those of you who have been following me for years know I'm a night owl, and this is when I feel I'm in my prime. So uh, we're ready to go. We've got a seven-star play in college football that goes Saturday. Uh, we're three and one so far with our top plays of the week in college football so far this season. And these seven-star and top plays, we used to call them main events back in the day uh, are now on a 41 and 24 run after cashing again last weekend. I've also got NFL. I'm starting out with tonight's play between the Broncos and the Jets. That's part of this week's package from me over at DocSports.com. We're going to kick things off with tonight's NFL and I've got NFL right through the weekend and of course I've got a top play from Sunday's NFL. So multiple game card again. Seven star in college football. We like to go to 42 and 24 with those plays. Top play in Sunday's NFL. It all kicks off tonight in the NFL clash between the Broncos and the Jets. And again, you can get it today, Thursday. It's Football Thursday at DocSports.com. Check out my Handicappers homepage. That's not all. Yesterday, a nice sweep in Major League Baseball. We hit the play here, the free pick. We hit both of our premium picks over at DocSports.com, including a nice five-star winner on the Yankees. Boy, was that a heck of a back and forth, and they came through for us in the end. So, real nice 3-0 sweep when it came to free picks and premium picks in baseball yesterday. I do have a premium pick, a five-star play going on Thursday available over at DocSports.com on my Capper's homepage. And also wanted to mention that we've got a daytime play in soccer. It's a six-star play. I haven't had a ton of these of late, uh, but we're up over $3,400 on our current run with seven-star and six-star soccer plays. Those are our elite-level plays over at DocSports.com. If you're betting just $100 per unit, you're up over $3,400 with those plays. Six-star play going on uh, in daytime action on Thursday. So that's a lot, man. We got football on Thursday uh, for the entire week and including the seven star Saturday, including the top play Sunday, including tonight's Broncos Jets play. And we've also got, again, soccer and Major League Baseball. So check it all out. And uh, almost forgot, we will have Korean Baseball for uh, tonight. Uh, Korean Baseball League now playing uh, 10 p.m. Pacific or 1 a.m. the next morning games Eastern time. We uh, are already in the win column uh, with the late game on a Wednesday night as we laid the run and a half with NC and they beat SK uh, by a 10 to 2 final. So a lot going on for me on Thursday, but again, the star of the show is my college football and NFL weekend card Thursday right through Monday over at DocSports.com along with that seven star play. All right, let's get to our free pick for today and a real quick programming note, by the way, again, late Thursday afternoon, early evening, I am going to post my first college football play for the weekend, so you have plenty of time to watch that. And if you agree with me, jump on board. Let's get to our free play uh, for Thursday. It's, we've got all these games in Major League Baseball, uh, a few less than yesterday after some teams wrapped up their series, uh, but we're going to go back to baseball for Thursday. Yesterday on this report, we mentioned to play the over between St. Louis and San Diego. Real nice when you get a four spot in the top half of the first inning, and uh, that one was decided within a couple of innings as far as the total was concerned. Today, first half total, the first five innings is sitting at five, a little bit of juice, buck 15 on the under and that's what we're going to do with this game. The Cardinals of the Padres, first five innings under the total of five. You got Wayne Wright and you got Davies, and I'm checking all the books right now, and it looks like that's going to be uh, the best that you're going to be able to find. About a buck 15 juice on that under five. Here's the situation when I look at these two teams. First of all, I like both pitchers in this spot. Both have done well for the most part, especially Davies in his first couple of times through the uh, batting order, but so has Wayne Wright for the most part, and I think you'll see that again here. All also, uh, my favorite offensive metric, how to judge teams, is WOBA, uh, W-O-B-A, as most of you know, I'm sure. And what it does is it basically combines every aspect of hitting. It, it properly weighs each outcome. And again, when you look at the St. Louis Cardinals and you look at their WOBA on the road against right-handers, it is nothing to brag about at all. In fact, it's a detriment. They've got a uh, 303 WOBA on the road against right-handers, which is bottom third in the league. And it's 
that close to being a poor Woba. It's below average, that's for sure. And I don't think they're going to do a lot of damage in the first five innings, first couple of times through the batting order against Davies. So uh, we think that also Wayne Wright can hold down the Padres enough through the first couple of times through the order, getting through that fifth inning, where we're going to keep this game under the total of five. So again, first five innings play on the under. It's five is the total as I cut this video on those first five innings between the Cardinals and the Padres. Wayne Wright and Davies, your expected starters in that one. And let's look to make it 4-0 this week with these free pick videos. Hey, don't forget again about the football plays over at DocSports.com. They post on Thursday. And again, seven-star playing college football, looking to go to 4-1 and one with our top college football plays on the season, looking to go to 42-24 and 24 with our top football plays going back several years now. Last 472 NFL plays, we are hitting 59% against the spread. So those are available too. College football, NFL, same package, and you can grab it today along with soccer, along with my premium Major League Baseball. All right, listen, if you like the videos, click on that thumbs up button. Be sure to subscribe. I do appreciate those who have done so thus far. I'm Scott Spritzer, DocSports.com. Promise you we'll be back early on Thursday evening with our first look to Saturday's college football with a free pick. We'll talk to you then.